Hello there folks, these are the hands of me Dan Brown from a sort of interesting life.com and today you're joining me to open up this box and hopefully find a pair of Slazenger Venture 61s. As far as I can tell that's their name but there's an awful lot of random words, letters and numbers on the side of this box. And for anybody who watches my videos regularly, then you will know that I traditionally pretty much only wear camouflage clothing, browns, greens, blacks, traditional sort of countryside clothing, I suppose. And the only real exception to that is, well, at the minute my watch in this video, typically, but every year I buy a new pair of proper sensible boots, and a pair of absolutely awful garish trainers, which you can see my previous years lined up here for context. And literally that was 2012, 2013, 2014, and now 2015. So if I can get these properly lined up in shot there, without further ado, here we go. Yes. Blue and yellow this time, and my goodness me, these, especially because these trainers in the background are so worn and muddy, are looking about as bright and garish as I could have possibly hoped. Now, if we just have a quick look, this video is only really intended as a general overview. It's not a proper review or anything like that, because obviously I would need to wear these for like a matter of months before I could give you any useful input. But I just thought we'd have a quick 360 of these so that anybody who's looking online at buying a pair can get a general feel of exactly what they look like. And well, as I said to the assistant in the shop, my exact words when he said, oh, are you after anything in particular? Were, well, I'm after the most sensible pair of shoes I can find and held up and said, which are these? Which were the ones in this box? And also the most garish, which I think are those to which I immediately tried a pair of size nines of each on and then proceeded to immediately purchase both of them. It's a, it's a quick process when it comes to actually um, purchasing the shoes and trying them on, but it literally takes me months and months to decide which shoes that I really want. So, like I say, I'm not able to obviously give you an amazing insight into what these are like and whether they're going to fall apart after two seconds, but I think that they should hold up pretty well given the, my previous experience. But like I say, I really just wanted to give you the quick 360. And ultimately, I suppose I should cut this video pretty short, pretty quick. So I will say thank you very much for watching. Feel free to check out my other videos for loads of my normal type of videos, which is getting out there in the countryside, living on a boat, traveling down the canals and all sorts of things, boaty, walking, biking. The outdoors in general. Until the next time though, keep it shoe worthy, keep it boat worthy, check the links in the descriptions for loads of, well just loads of stuff and <laughs> I'll let you discover what's down there yourself. But until next time, have a fantastic day and farewell.